I'll be showing you the best review app for your Shopify store, and I'll be showing you how to set this up step by step so you can start adding social proof and reviews to your Shopify store in just a few minutes. So the app we're going to be using in today's video is called judge.me product reviews, and it has over 42,000 reviews, a perfect five star rating and a very generous free forever plan. So you can find this on the Shopify app store. I'll also leave a link in the description below, but once on this page, all you have to do is click install. If you're comfortable with the permissions, we'll just click install again. And this brings us to the start section of the app. First, Step, we have to select our language. I'm going to leave this as English. Next step, it's going to ask us where we want to install it. By default, it's going to select your current theme. So I'm just going to leave that there. I'll click start setup. And next we want to enable the app embed. So this can be done in the theme settings, but it's much faster if you just click this button here. It's going to open up a new tab opening up the Shopify theme editor, and it's going to open up the app embed section automatically. This is on the left hand side of your store under app embeds. We can see it's toggled on. Now all we have to do is go and save this in the top right and head back to our previous tab. I can see it now shows it's been enabled. Next, we have to install the widgets. Now mine says it's already installed because I did do some testing before this, but I'm going to click on this as if I've never done it before. And I've deleted them as well, so we can start from scratch together. Now my default, it's going to add these star ratings. I can see it on the left hand side here. So if you've never been to the Shopify theme editor, it basically blocks we can move around. And so it added the star ratings and I want them to be above the title here. So I've just dragged them below. You can really put them wherever you want. So you can hit save here to finalize that part. We head back to the previous tab. It's now gonna ask us to set up the branding. With the star color, maybe I want a brighter yellow here and I'll hit continue. Next, it's gonna ask us about automatic review requests. So these are review requests emails sent for new orders automatically. And we can confirm the timing here. Now you probably wanna set this to maybe a week or a few days after they've received the product. It's going to depend on your store's shipping times. I'll just leave both of these as 14 here. Next, I'll click finish. And now let's click explore. Judge me. So first up, we get a dashboard basically of the reviews over time, the request sent, the average rating. But what I want to do is go and add the review widget so customers can go and leave reviews for my products. So I'll head back to the Shopify theme tab. And if I go to add section, go over to apps here, I can see all of the judge me sections I can then add to my theme. I'm looking for the review widget, which is right there. And if I scroll down now on this page, I can see it at the bottom. So it's based on my colorway and I can see some sample reviews here. So I'll just hit save to finalize that. And this should apply to every product in my store. So at its most basic, we just added the review stars and the review widget to our store. Now let's go for an overview of just the other sections of Judge Me as there are quite a few features here. And I'll just go over some of the major ones you might want to be aware of. The first one is the manage review section. So if we go into the sub menu here, you can see all the reviews being left for your store. And if you would like as well, you could actually hide these or feature or pin them as well. And here you can see all the reviews written. So it's important to just to keep tabs on these. Next up is the collect review section. And we can see the requests being sent out. You can also go and edit the email settings or the templates as well in terms of the review requests. You should probably go and edit the email template as you want it to match your store's branding. And even when you go in here, you want to make sure that you probably added a logo just so the customer doesn't think it looks unprofessional. Lastly is the widget section. Now, when we went over the Shopify theme editor, you could see there are quite a few different widgets you can add. Now what you add is up to you, but under the widget section here, we can actually go and customize the appearance of each of them, whether that's just the plain review widget, the star badge, the pop-up reviews, and more. To customize any of them, just click and customize. We can go and customize the color as well as some of the display properties. And we get a nice preview on the right here. What's nice as well is we can see which ones are installed just by this little installed tag. If you've made any sales on Shopify, you know how hard it is to keep track of how much money your store is actually made. And that's where our sponsor Profit Calc comes in. It's a one-click profit calculator available for your Shopify store. Once set up, all you have to do is select the date range you're looking for to get real-time calculations, to integrate seamlessly with all your different ad accounts, as well as many cost of goods sold providers. And it's gonna give you tons of analytics, metrics, and breakdowns so you can start making smarter business decisions. There's a 15-day free trial so you can test drive everything for yourself and I'll leave a link in the description below. You could also find it on the Shopify app store, just searching for profit calc and then looking for this logo in the top left here. Again, there's a 15 day free trial, so make sure you test it out. And so that's an overview of judge.me. It's an extremely popular review app that has a very generous free forever plan 
and there's a reason why it has 42,000 reviews and a perfect five-star rating. Also to note, I don't have any affiliation with this app. So this concludes the video here on the best review app for your Shopify store. If you enjoyed this video, I would love it so much if you smash that like and subscribe button below. If you have any questions, leave a comment, but thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video.